To Anderson's TV. It's all about the bass. I'm Nathan. And I am Pete. He is Pete. Hey, I'm Pete. I'm sitting in for Lee at the moment today. Well, today, uh, he had some car troubles and got stuck somewhere. Uh, and uh, we, the show must go on. The show must, the go, show on. must go on. Indeed, as, as, as somebody once said. Hey, look at yeah. that. Do you know what? I'm loving these peach. Would you say this yeah, is peach? Loving these peach no, I, would say, I would say it's a, it's a rusty orange. <laughs> <laughs> or something like that, isn't it? It's more, uh, it's a burnt orange, that's what it's called. Burnt umber. I think it's oh. a burned umber, uh, something like that. Like well, I like I, in my I pizza like oven, it. burnt I think it's, crust. It's, it's definitely an improvement on it whatever is. we have before. I mean, it's, it's an interesting, it? you know, we, we're trying to, uh, to make it different for you guys, so it's not always the same. Uh, and as COVID restrictions are lifting, we're going to get more people in. I'm thinking, um, though, because we're sat lower now, can they just see sort of like... It's head? just the heads they can see and you like can't that. see any bases, so it's kind of no, useless. No, 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 no. You just no, have to no, imagine no, what no, they look no. like. Exactly. But, you know, your face is what they're here for. Well, so, that's very true. what are we true. looking at today, Nathan? <laughs> well, 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 well. Three holes in a row. You might well ask. It is this very nice. Well, these actually. These actually. These very very nice. Uh, yeah. Ibanez. Um, um, well, do you know what? I could tell you what it's called, uh, but it would take me about a week. Hang on. Are you ready for this? Yeah, are we ready for this? An S R five C M L T D dash C I L <laughs> with dash bag. I tell you what, what. We were there were a video. Snappy, isn't it? It's just it's such a name. It sticks. It rolls right off the tongue. <laughs> it sticks in your brain. We did do actually. There was a video when we, when Ibanez and Lee Rafe did a takeover of uh, the channel last year or earlier this year or I can't remember when. I think was it before COVID. It's all blending into one these last couple of years. So I can't really. But they took over and they had a chat about what the numbers. And model numbers and why Ibanez uh, calls him. So maybe yeah. if Felix can go and put a video up here right. where they actually, if that's still available, they talk about why really? it is that they call them these things. You know, for instance, like Martin will have. If you're watching that, you've got too much time in your head. <laughs> exactly. I mean, it's like Martin will do E for electrics and C for cutaway, and right. you know they'll have N for of nylon. Course, it all makes so sense. It all makes sense. Yeah, but, so and I think there's a similar thing with these, but. S R four C M L T D dash S I L one P dash zero one V dash back. I mean, it's not the. the I'll just say the blue base with the with the wooden yeah, pickups. It's, it's it. the new nice Ibanez <laughs> bases look, and very nice they are too. I mean, they no, look it's stunning. Not detract man. from that. No. Yeah. Really. Has it got a bit of um, it's body shape? Is that a bit um? I was going to say Warricky. Warricky maybe, or maybe maybe no, still, maybe I shouldn't be saying that. No, I don't. I don't think so. No, I think no? this is this is Ibanez's this own own sort of thing. Yeah, it looks very Ibanez so to what, me. So what what kind of speggeroni, speggeroni? Speggeroni. Uh, well, uh, the, we've got the oh. neck. Uh, the fretboard is Panga Panga. Panga Panga Panga. panga. Yo, those guys with kids would know what that is. Uh, five piece purple heart um, on the back. Beautiful neck. Uh, yes. Uh, Nordstrand pickups. Nordstrand. Very nice. I'm saying that because I can't remember what the body's made of. Well, so. it's, it looks like some kind of flame maple sort of thing, but it looks like it's it's layered up in layers, maybe glued together or something, and then well, obviously it's lots of bits stuck together. A lot of kind bits of stuck that together. Way, yeah. But this way, 
Yes. If you look, if you look on the back of it, it looks it's pretty cool, isn't it? It's it's very nice. With yeah. a see-through sort of finish on it, really thin lacquer. Yes, translucent. Translucent. Mm -hmm. But you can see the you can see and feel the grain through it, which is quite cool. I like. I like. Yeah, they're, they're really nice bases. These are kind yeah. of the Ibanez premium uh, bases. Okay. So it's kind right. of towards the top end of what they're making, you know. It's the because obviously they do some very affordable bases. Yeah, as we know, but they, these are not those. Um, um, so these pickups are made of wood. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. Or maybe it's just a wood cover. <laughs> it's very nice. Yeah, uh, Nordstrand you... pickups, um, which are single coil, but very uh, you know very heavily wound, so you get a nice sort of uh, thick sound out of them. I like the way the pickups are, or the the the, the pole pieces are kind of not straight on. It's yeah. Sort of a it's a good design. I like it. It looks cool. It looks cool. Yeah. And then you got your Ibanez kind of uh, thingy with the three being at band EQ and the on and off and all that stuff. You have to explain that. I will. Um, um, I'm going to put this bass down here. Yeah. The four string version, and you got the five string version. Yes. I'm saying there's not much point in playing both is there? No, but, there's a zero because they're exactly the same apart from this one's got one more string. Yeah. And uh, I like this um, finish. What's that called? What, the colour? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Caribbean Islet. <laughs> is islet? Islet. Islet. Not inlet. What is no eyelet? Is how you pronounce it. Islet. What's an eyelet? I don't know. Is it is, is it a? Eyelid. It's not an eyelet. I really don't know. Eyelet. Eyelet. Is it a place? Caribbean eyelet. I I guarantee. I probably. I think not guarantee. I think it's like. Isn't that where the water? Uh, it's an from the island and it lets in water. Oh. So you see the sand and then the sea. See beach. That's brilliant. You were beach. I think you're right. Naughty there. beach. That's what they. That's what they're getting at here. Yeah. Is a Caribbean paradise. In your own hands, quite frankly. <laughs> That's how I feel every time I go to the toilet. Yeah, that would That's... make sense. Uh, <laughs> and now these are limited edition too. Uh, okay, limited uh, edition. Okay. Yeah, these are uh, limited edition bases. Um, a nice feature is the 24 fret, of course. I, I like that. Uh -huh. I'd never use it, but it's nice to have, isn't it? It is. You know I, mean? I, I, don't, I have no idea. I'm, uh, I'm, a, I'm a guitar player. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, good point. Uh, with 24 frets. Yeah, um, and uh, yeah, it's, it's nice. Do you want to know what these controls do? I would uh, love to hear it does what they do, because I know it's, um, I mean, you. Are the, I'm sure there will be some more videos on the Ibanez stuff with you and Lee that oh, yeah. you can go and check out up there. But yeah, it, l let me just tell me what they do. So I will tell you what they do. So starting here, volume. Volume, yeah. Pick up balance. Pick up balance between the two. There's a little nice notch there in the middle. Notch in the middle, yeah. They all got notch. No, no. They all got a notch. Not the not the vol. Not the vol. Okay. Uh, okay. And then we've got um, EQ here. Yeah. Bass middle but, treble. But strangely, uh, kind of the other way around to what I'm used to. On most other basses, it goes bass middle treble. Yeah. Not on this. It goes bass middle treble. So oh. it goes round that way. Can you not? Bases if, can front. you open up this plate and just swap them out? If uh, you want I wouldn't there. recommend it. I really wouldn't. <laughs> Just, no, just it, deal with it. All you have to do is swap these two over. Oh, got come on. Ah. You've got to be kidding. Wait, this is, that's for another video. I promise yeah. you. We're not going to start hacking it together now. <laughs> hacking it apart. If you want to do it at home, fine. Fine. With no uh, refunds. And how about the... What's these um, yeah, yeah, switches? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm getting... I'm getting... Okay. I'm just impatient here. You know, know, I've, got, you, I've know. got places to do and people to see. And no, you haven't. People to do. To do. <laughs> places to see. Uh, yeah, this switch is the active on and off. Two, yeah, little 2-1. Yeah, um, we're just nine volt active preamp in here. No. Uh, and then uh, when that is engaged, obviously this EQ is active. And then this little one at the, the back here is, uh, you've got three way switch and it's three different mid frequencies. Okay. I think it's 250, 450 and 700. Holy smokes. Yeah, so you've got three different mid frequencies that you can cut or boost. Okay, let me when show you here. The, when, on... the, when the active isn't on, when it's in passive mode, yeah. the treble acts as a general tone. Okay. So on, the, on this guitar here, yeah. you've got a three-way selector switch, you've got yes. a volume and yes. a tone. Yes. And that's it. Isn't that clever? I mean, I can't believe that nobody's thought about that. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> it's just so simple. Yeah, but it's, it'll never catch on. And I tell you, I don't think they're going to sell many just, of those at all. And doing this yeah. all the way up. Yeah. See, he's not a bass player. He doesn't understand. <laughs> just ignore him, everybody. <laughs> Come on, I think it's great. He's I mean, being for the, very I don't silly. Know, are these, are these Listen, limited edition, are they expensive you know, though? Yeah, but you guitar players with your pedals, you're constantly, I want this pedal, I want that pedal. No, I've got one, I can you know. play with one pedal, that's all I need. But 
Oh, if I'm on a bike, I need two. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Where do you plug the batteries in? Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, so there we go. Should we have a listen to see what it sounds so like? So, before you do that, pricing, are they expensive? For, for the four, yeah. it is 1599 Okay. So, no, one, not... £1,600. Yeah. Uh, and then another £100 for this one. For an extra string. Excuse me. Yeah, I, but I always think that's really good value, actually. Another 100 quid, and you get... Um, you know, it's a little bit more wood here, maybe a bit of wood there, and bigger yeah, pickups. And... Yeah, you know string. what? Let's hear it. Let's stop rambling. We're rambling. Let's hear it. Okie dokie. Base so, video is always so short, apart from when I'm in them. <laughs> uh, yes. So passive-wise, then let's have a quick listen to that. Oh. Uh, back pickup. Mm -hmm. So that tone control. Yes. I'll, I'll turn that off. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh, up a bit. All the way up. Mm. Mm. So even for passive, that's still quite lively, isn't it? I oh. think so, yeah. All right. I mean, it's like honky, isn't it? It's, it's got this um, <laughs> going on in it. Well, it has, it has. Front pickup, uh -huh. do the same vibe. Do it. That's nice. That's cool. Both pickups. Taking that, that, yeah. Both pickups, tone off. Mm -hmm. Yes, Bit liking more. it, liking oh, it. Half the tone. And then all the tone. So even passive, you've still got a nice bit of brightness there. Uh, we kick the EQ in. Yeah. Uh, and start messing them out with that a little bit. Uh, for instance, back pick up, mid up. And we can select the frequency. That's for honky. Oh yeah, that's all right. That's kind of workable, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Front pick up, front, <laughs> front pick up. Let's do <laughs> something with that. that? What was it? Who <laughs> started it? Can I just add, if you if you're in the room, that is a thump. Sound. Thump. Yeah, yeah. That's a problem. It is. We're going through this uh, little Ampeg combo. Holy smoke. 115 in there. Yeah, it's nice, though, isn't wow. it? Wow. Yeah, that is, that is punchy. It's a punchy sound. It's punchy a punchy sound. sound. Right. All so right. Let's have a bit of in the middle. Um, let's smiley. Stuck in the middle with let's smiley you. face it a little bit. So, smiley. Uh, cut mid out, bit of bottom, bit of top. Very focused, very focused yes. sound. tones in there there's a whole load of lo there is just absolutely you know i've literally just shown you shown you about half a dozen but there's, there's so much you can do because yeah. of the parametric eq yeah there's just crazy amounts of different tones you can get out of this thing well there um, you go and uh, they all seem to be quite pleasant i have to say yeah uh you know let's see what it's like with the pick I mean, quickly the pick a bit of a pick mm. yes That's pretty good, 
it? There you go. I uh, mean, what? That's that's <clears throat> it's great base. It's a really great base. Uh, you know, obviously, it's it's one of their premium bases. You know? Yeah, yeah. So you you'd expect expect it to be to be good. Here's the. Uh, you get a lovely bag with it. The bag. It says Ibanez on the yeah. front. It's a Bilbo Baggins. Hey. Uh, <laughs> look, it opens. Yeah, it does. It's got a and it thing on the, the front. Floor. You can put things in. Yep. That's it. Absolutely. What's in that? What's in here? Oh, I, I, I don't know. Ah! No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Tell me you've got the key. Yeah, exactly. Nah, there's nothing in there. A little maintenance thing and, and that's it. But what? there we go. Nothing else to say, is there? I think that's it, really. I think we've covered all the, all the bases. <laughs> um, See you later, guys. Thanks for watching. <laughs> oh, my God, it's dad jokes. Uh, there you go. Look, your little thing there. You can get your battery in and out nice and easy. You don't yeah. need a screwdriver for that. Good. Um, yeah, um, yeah, that's about it, really. Go to machine heads. Uh, yeah, don't know what else I can tell you. Where nice. do the neck? Oh, this down here. Because sometimes they've got that little opening up here, haven't they? The little... Oh, for the uh, truss rod, you mean? Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, truss rod adjustment right there, nice and easy. Uh, yeah, no, it's, it's, it's all good, man. All well, good. there you go. Links below for this. If you want more videos for bass and stuff, subscribe, like, and do all that stuff. And uh, click on the pop-up banner up there if you want to see any more stuff. And uh, go and follow Nathan on Instagram as well. Don't follow yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, I'll see what nothing. he gets up to. He's going gigging soon, so he's going to put all kinds of funky pictures up on his Instagram for you to uh, to watch. Oh no. Because that's what do he does all the time. <laughs> oh no, what have you done to me? Yeah. Go right, maybe it. I will because I'll him. have lots of time on tour, so maybe I'll do that. Yeah, you should do that. Do a little diary. What's going on? Today I'm in A little you know, diarrhea. Well you might if you go it depends on where you go these days, isn't it? Anyway, nice to see you all. Thank you for watching. Thank all you about the base. All about the base, yeah. yes indeed. I've been Nathan. And I am Danish Pete. Uh, if you enjoyed it, obviously subscribe, yes. press the links, do the thing and the what and the hat and the hoot. And uh, yeah, great, we'll see you next time. Thanks folks, bye!